Hello, tech enthusiasts. Welcome to today's video where we're diving deep into the world of processors. Those tiny yet mighty components that power our devices and make the digital magic happen. So, let's get started. Let's discuss about the role of processors. At the core of every computer and electronic device is a processor, also known as a CPU or central processing unit. It's the brain that executes instructions, performs calculations, and handles all the tasks we throw at it. Now, let's break down some key aspects of the processors that you should know. 1. Architecture Processors are built with a specific architecture that defines their capabilities. The two main types of processor architectures are complex instruction set computing, CISC, and reduced instruction set computing, RISC. RISC processors focus on simpler instructions, while CISC processors can execute more complex instructions. 2. Clock speed. Clock speed, measured in Hertz, HZ, or Gigahertz, GHZ, indicates how many instructions a processor can execute per second. Higher clock speeds generally lead to faster performance, but other factors also influence overall speed. 3. Cores. Modern processors often have multiple cores, which are like separate processing units within the same chip. Having multiple cores allows a processor to handle multiple tasks simultaneously, improving multitasking performance. 4. Threads. Threads are units of execution within a core. Processors can support multiple threads per core through technologies like simultaneous multi-threading, SMT, or hyper-threading. This enhances multitasking by allowing each core to work on multiple tasks at once. 5. Cache memory. Processors have cache memory, which is faster but smaller than the main memory, RAM. It stores frequently used data and instructions, reducing the time needed to access them. 6. Instruction pipelining. Pipelining allows processors to overlap the execution of multiple instructions, improving efficiency by reducing idle time. It breaks down instruction execution into stages. 7. Die size and transistors. The physical size of the processor's integrated circuit, IC, is its die size. More transistors on the die generally indicate greater processing power. 8. Manufacturing process. Processors are manufactured using a specific process node, measured in nanometers, NM. Smaller process nodes allow for more transistors in a smaller space, leading to increased performance and energy efficiency. And there you have it, a crash course on processors, the unsung heroes of our digital lives. From clock speeds to cores, architecture to manufacturing, these components are the beating heart of modern technology. Thanks for watching. Please make sure to subscribe to our channel for tech reviews, unboxings, and tech news. Don't forget to like and leave a comment down below and share this video with your friends and family. We'll see you soon.